In 2020, researchers showed off how Animal, a four-legged robot, could amble across a variety of settings without falling. But this version of Animal wasn't able to anticipate what its next steps would reveal. The robot was relying solely on proprioceptive perception, awareness of its internal state, such as leg positioning or speed. Since the robot had to feel out its environment, it moved slowly through space. To increase animal speed, researchers at ETH Zurich added exteroceptive perception onto the bot, the ability for animal to see upcoming terrain. The researchers installed depth sensors that animal used to plan its future steps while maintaining speed and stability. But these maps aren't perfect. The depth sensors interpret soft, unstable surfaces such as snow, as solid surfaces that can't be walked on. As a fix, the researchers trained Animal to revise its map when proprioceptive perception conflicted with exteroceptive perception. Before seeing this strategy in action, they had to train the robot's controller, the computer system in charge of the robot's movements, how to navigate in a variety of settings. The researchers created a virtual environment where the controller could experience different terrains faster than the real world. One controller had access to a lot of information about its surroundings, from terrain to friction, so that it could develop optimal movements. In real life, Animal would not have access to so much data, so they taught a student controller to mimic these ideal behaviors using only a height map. They added noise to the height map in tests to simulate scenarios where the depth sensors might fail. Then, it was time to test Animal in the lab. They set a foam block in front of Animal, which appeared as a solid surface on its terrain map. Once Animal stepped on the obstacle, the robot altered its terrain map downward, stepping on top of the block with its hind legs. To test the robot's skills in the real world, the researchers had Animal take a hike through Etzel Mountain in Switzerland. The robot smoothly traversed a path riddled with roots and vegetation, completing the hike about as quickly as a human could. In most experiments, the researchers could see Animal as they controlled it with a joystick. They successfully deployed the robot semi-autonomously during the DARPA Subterranean Challenge. Instead of actively controlling its direction, a human sent Animal a command to move to its next position, and the robot would plan its own path there. In one hour, four Animal robots, alongside several flying bots, successfully explored an underground circuit of tunnels and caves. They won the competition by detecting 23 hidden artifacts along their path. It's a promising start to how researchers envision Animal's destiny leading search and rescue missions or exploring planets. In the future, researchers hope to deploy Animal fully autonomously. Don't be alarmed if you see Animal being tested in an environment near you.